my name is Tracy Randolph and I'm from Mystic, Connecticut. Today's class is going to be a combination of both seated and standing exercises. The purpose of this class is to help you to build strength while standing and then working some nice stretching motions from the seated position. So it's a combination of two types of programs that I think you'll really enjoy. So starting off, I'm gonna have you come up from your chair and move around to the back of the chair. If you're doing this exercise program from your home, you wanna make sure that you have a nice sturdy chair with you when you're doing these things. So up behind the chair, you wanna look down at the feet and make sure they're both playing the same game, meaning they're both pointing straight ahead. You wanna have your legs to be about hip distance apart. And when we're talking about hip distance, we're truly talking about that midline going straight down through the thigh. That's where we're looking for those feet to be. Your hands can be on the seat back. If you feel good with this exercise, you don't need to hold on, but for safety purposes, keeping just a fingertip on there is a good idea. So we're going to be lifting up to the toes as high as you can get. Here we go, and it's lift. One, lift, two, lift, three, lift, four, lift, five, lift, six, lift, seven, lift, eight. Super job from here. Let's go all the way up on those toes. Nice and high, as high as you can get and hold it here for a slow count of eight, seven, hang in there, six, five, four, three, two, and one, and come all of the way down. Great job. From here, I'm going to have you turn your body to the right so that the left side of your body is facing your seat back. Your left hand is holding onto the seat back and your legs are wider than hip distance apart. Your right arm is up in the air and your right arm should be aligned with your right ear. And I want you to gently lean over to that left hand side. Get a nice big stretch out of this. You wanna really press both feet firmly into the floor. Keep that face looking straight ahead Hang in there for four, you got it, three, two, and one. Great job, bring that right arm straight up and then release it down by your side. From here, let's switch that around now. Turn your body so that the right side faces the seat back. Your right hand is holding onto that chair. The idea of holding on is not only for balance, but also too to help protect the lower back. We don't wanna to put too much strain on the lower back. Left arm is straight up in the air, both feet pressing firmly down. Now gently lean over to your right hand side. Big stretch, don't let that left heel come up from the floor. Great job and hold it here for a slow count of four. Three, you can do it. Two, and one. And bring that left arm up and release it down. Good. From here, I'm gonna turn my chair. I want you to stay behind your chair, but I'm going to do this so that you can see what the exercise looks like. Standing behind your chair, you're going to turn so that the right side of your body is facing your seat back. Great job. Holding on either with your hand or just a fingertip, I want you to take and lift your right knee up in the air. Great job. From here, I want you to kick your right foot straight out for a slow count of eight and seven. Kick it out for six, five, you got it, four, three, two, and one, relax it down. Stay right where you are. Left leg is going to come up and let's kick it out for a slow count of eight, seven. Stay up tall, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And relax it down. Take and step that right leg out in front of the body. And again, you can either hold on with just a fingertip or place your hand on the seat back. Stomach is in nice and tight. 
thinking about the word lift and lifting your right leg straight up. Here we go. Lift. One. Lift. Two. Lift. Three. Lift. Four. Lift. Five. Lift. Six. Lift. Seven. Lift. Eight. Relax that down. Go over to that left leg now. Same thing. Here we go. Lift. One. Lift. Two. Lift. Three. Lift. Four. Lift. Five. Lift. Six. Lift. Seven. Lift. Eight. And down. Relax that foot down. From here, bring the hands to the front of your thighs, chin to your chest, sliding down for a slow count for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, keep going, two, and one. In this position, your head should be looking back at your body and not straight down. Head is turned in, looking at the legs, no pain or tension in the neck or the face. Hang in there. You can do it and slowly up for eight, seven, curl up through that spine, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And relax it down. Good, staying behind your chairs now. I want you to give yourself a nice wide stance here. Your toes are pointing straight ahead. Great job. And I want you to take and place your right hand in the center of your seat. I want you to lift your left arm up. Here we go. And you're gonna push over into that left leg. I want you to notice a couple of things here. The first one is that my hips go back and my knee begins to bend. Left arm is up overhead and press it up. So it's down. One, down. Two, down. Three, down. Four, you got it, down. Five, down. Six, down. Seven, down and eight, great job. Right arm comes up, here we go. And it's down, one, down, two, down, three, down, four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down, and eight. And relax it down, great job. From here, step those feet back together. Great job, and I'm going to change the position of my chair. Remember, you're staying right where you are. My chair is coming in front of my body so you can see me straight on from this position. I want you to take and place both arms across the front of your chest. You're going to be standing with your feet together in this position. Get those heels and toes to get nice and close to each other. The hands will come across the front of your chest Remember, you're a nice, safe distance from the seat back here. Take a moment to ground the feet to the floor. So instead of feeling like you're balancing on those feet, I want you to push them down into the floor. Hands come across the chest, and you're going to close your eyes. Again, if you feel unstable, keep one hand on the seat back. For a slow count, eyes closed. 10, 9, 8, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And relax those arms down. Great job, hang in there. Keep those feet in that same position here. Bring the arms back across the front of your chest. Feet are nice and close. And I want you to lean forward to your 12 o'clock position. Don't let those heels come up. Push those heels down. The body's leaning forward and going in a clock motion with the body all the way around to 12 o'clock again. Starting at 12, we're going over to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, 
12. Remember, the torso and the legs are moving together, moving around in that big sway envelope area. Here we go, counterclockwise to 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and 12 o'clock. Great job, hang in there. From here, relax the arms down by your side. I want you to step your left foot out to the side and your right arm is reaching up to the ceiling. If you need to hold on, place that left hand gently on the seat back. Circle that right arm around, nice big circles. Now lift that left foot up and hold for a slow count of eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, and release it down. Here we go, let's switch it around again. Right foot goes out to the side, left arm is lifted up. Start to circle your left arm around, nice big circles, and lift that right foot and hold for eight, seven, six, five, you can do it, four, three, two, and one, and relax it down. Great job here. From here, step your body out to the left hand side of your chair. I'm gonna have you bring your arms to the front of your chest. Now, if you feel at all unsafe doing this, you can keep your hands on the seat back, but if not, I'm going to have you, and I'll demonstrate one slow one. Step your right foot out to the side, lower your hips down, and slide the foot in and the count will be one and we're going for eight here here we go stepping out one out two out three out four out five out six out seven and out that's eight wonderful job Step out to the right side now. This time the left foot is going out. Here we go. So it's out. One, out. Two, out. Three, out. Four, out. Five, out. Six, out. Seven, and out. That's eight. Great job. From here, take a nice wide stance with those legs. Your toes are pointing straight ahead. Nice little knee bend here. And I want you to put your hands on the seat back and lower your chest down. Here we go, pressing up with those elbows for eight. Down, seven, down, six, down, five, down, you got it. Four, down, three, down, two, down, and one, and down, and come all the way up. Great job. From here, you're going to take and turn your body to the right again, and I'm going to have you step your right foot behind you, and your left arm is going straight out. This is kind of like a modified Superman position. Here's a couple of keys. Keep your left knee bent. Don't let that knee lock out. Nice bend to the left knee. Left arm is straight out. And now that right leg is going to lift up to the back for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Great job. This time I will have you turn your position around. So you're going to take and switch all that around. Right arm goes straight out, left leg steps back, right knee has a little bend to it. We kind of get our bang for our buck here. We're working the left leg and the right leg at the same time, chest forward, left leg is going to, let me reposition and lift up for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, and relax it down. Wonderful 
job facing that chair again for me. I'm going to have you take and turn the toes. They're pointing straight ahead. I want you to bring the arms forward. Nice little circle to the position of the arms. So nice circle all of the way out and through. And I want you to take and rock your torso to the right, center, left, center, right, center, left, center, right, center, left, three, right, center, left, four, right, center, left, five, right, center, left, six, right, center, left, seven, right, center, left, and eight. The idea of that exercise is to keep the hips stabilized, moving that torso right and left. Great job. I'm going to take and turn my chair again. You stay right where you are. And I'm going to have you take and turn your body again so that the right side is facing the seat back, left arm is up in the air, and you're going to be pulling that right knee up as you pull that left arm down. Here we go. So it's pull. One, pull, two, pull, three, pull, four, pull, five, pull, six, pull, seven, pull, and eight. Great job. You're going to switch that around now, and I'm going to have you turn your body this time so that the left side of your body is holding on or turn towards the seat and left hand holding on right arm is up here we go right arm and left leg so it's pull one pull two pull three pull four you got it pull five pull six pull seven pull and eight and relax it down from here i'm going to have you take and come back down to your chairs so you're sitting on the front of your seat in this position here and i'm going to have you take and step your toes out in front of your knees hands come to the front of your thighs and i want you to lower the chest down get a nice gentle stretch to that lower back bring the chin down good and bring that body up nice work here we go right leg is going to come straight out in front this time the arms go straight up in the air the right foot is flexed we want to stay in this position don't rock back because the right leg will lift up here we go lift one lift two lift three lift four lift five lift six, lift, seven, lift, eight. Good, step your right foot in, left leg goes out, here we go, lift, one, lift, two, lift, three, lift, four, lift, five, lift, six, lift, seven, lift, and eight, and relax it down. Good, bring those arms to the front of your body and you're going to go out and in now. Here we go, out, one, out, two, out, three, out, four, out, five, out, six, out, seven, out, and eight. And relax it down. Now really come to the front edge of your seat. And I'm going to have you reach your hands down, lift up, that's one, and down, two, and down, three, and down, four, and down, five, and down, six, and down, seven, and down, and that's eight, and relax those arms down. Good, go back to that big wide stance here, and the right arm's gonna come out to the outside of your left leg, and then reach way over. So you're gonna come down. One, down, two, 
down, three, down, four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down, and eight. And relax it down. Good. Stay here for just one moment. Great job. Legs come back out to the side. This time it's the left hand and it's down. One, down, two, down, three, down, four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down, and eight and relax it down good legs come forward now i'm gonna have you going right leg out in left leg in here we go and it's right up left up right up left up right up left up right up left up four more right left, up, right, up, left, up, right, up, left, up, right, up, and left, up. Good job. Stay up nice and tall. Reaching forward. Good. Swimming it out. One, out. Two, out. Three, out. Four, out, five, out, six, out, seven, and out, that's eight. Wonderful job, here we go. Left leg is going to go out. One, out, two, out, three, out, four, out, five, out, six, out, seven, out, that's eight. Right leg, out. One, out, two, out, three, out, four, out, five, out, six, out, seven, out, that's eight. Good job. Arms come down by your side. Here we go. And I want you to curl the arms up and then slowly push them back. Feel the muscles in the back of the arm, the triceps engage as you push those knuckles back. Here we go. Curl it up. One, up. Two, up. Three, up. Four, up. Five, up. Six, up. Seven, up. And eight. And relax it down. I want you to hold on to the chair now. Hands are holding on to the seat back. Those feet are together. Knees are together. Hold the legs up. And I want you to kick right. Left. Down. Up. Right. Left. Down. Two. Right. Left. Down. Three. Right. Left. Down. Four. Right, left, down, five, right, left, down, six, right, left, down, seven, right, left, down, that's eight. Wonderful job. You guys are doing really good here. Take and extend that right leg out in front now. Place both hands on top of that right leg and I want you to lower the chest down. Good, nice gentle stretch. We're still gonna keep going, hang in there and press your body up. Good, switch it around. Left leg's gonna go out, lean that body forward. Good stretch here, hang in there. Great work, nice gentle stretch. Good job. And bring that body up. Go to that wide stance again here. We want to have a really good base of support and I want your right arm to reach out and in. That's one. Out. Two. Out. Three. Out. Four. Out. Five. Out. Six. Out. Seven. Out. That's eight. Left arm going out. One. Out. Two, out, three, out, four, out, five, out, six, out, seven, and out, that
that's a good job. From here, I want you to give your body a nice staggered stance with the legs, okay? And what I want you to practice doing is placing the hands on top of the legs and it's a little lift up and down. Don't come all the way up to standing, just little lifts here. That's all we're looking for. So it's up, one, up, two, up, three, up, four, up, five, up, six, up, seven, up, eight. Good job, switch it around, staggered stance the opposite way. This can sometimes be a little bit more challenging, so be aware of that, okay? And again, a little bit of a rocking motion helps to build up that effort we need to come up just a little. Here we go. So it's up, one, up. Two, control the down, up, three, up, four, up, five, up, six, up, seven, and up, and that makes a great job. Now I want you to take a nice wide stance with those legs, good job and that nose over toes exercise. So what we want to be able to do is get those legs out nice and wide and leaning forward, nose over toes, the hips lift up just a little and come back down. So here we go, nose over toes. So the word I want you to think about is that you're coming out over those toes. Here we go. So you're gonna come up. One, slow and controlled, up, two, and up, three, and up, four, and up, five, and up, six, good job, up, seven, and up, and that makes a great job. Bring those feet back in. From here, I want you to bring that right arm across the front of your body. Left arm comes to hug the elbow in. If you're in the right position here, your left hand should be saying hello to the face. And now bend that right arm up. Nice gentle stretch to that shoulder. Great job, wonderful job. Good, and relax it down. Left arm comes across, right arm comes up. Gentle pressure. Again, if you're in the right position, the right hand is saying hello to the face. And now the left arm comes up. Great job, excellent work here. Good, and relax it down. Bring that body back again. And I want you to take and pull the stomach in nice and tight. And I want you to imagine there's a heavy, heavy weight pushing the knee away from the body. We're kind of pressing the heel down and pulling the foot back in. Kind of an angled position from the floor. Here we go, so it's down. One, down. Two, down. Three, down. Four, down. Five, down. Six, down. Seven, down. That's eight, great job. Left knee, here we go. Down, one, down two, down, three, down, four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down, and that makes eight. Great job. Hands come to the front of your knees, toes are out in front of the knees, posture is tall, shoulders and hips aligned, and tap those toes up and down. Good. Working on that strong range of motion, Remember with this exercise, height matters. So tapping the toes, but lifting up high. Great work, good, good, good. Here we go and relax. Toes turn out to the side, heels in and tap. You might notice some of these positions are a little bit more challenging than others. Just keep in mind that height matters. Lift up as high as you can. Great work and relax. Now take and turn the toes in, heels rotate out. We sometimes call this the lonely girl tap, <laughs> but I don't think that's the case at all. Nice high toe lifts here. Great job and relax. Step those feet together.
together, heels go back, and now just let those heels tap up and down. Great job, excellent work here. Nicely done, good. And three, two, and one. Great job. Take that right arm out to the side, and that left arm's gonna come out in front. This is kind of a fun exercise to do. Left leg is gonna go out to the side. Here we go. What I want you to do is bring the arm in and out. In, one, in, two, in, three, in, four, in, five, in, six, in, seven, in, and eight. Good, switch that around. Right leg goes out, here we go. So it's in, one, in, two, in, three, in, four, in, five, in, six, in, seven, in, and eight. And relax that all of the way down. Nicely done. Hands come back to that chair now. Take that right leg out, left leg out. And I want you to make that stomach as tight as you can. Holding on to the chair, you can let the elbows relax back into that seat back. And I want you to start to lift those feet up, up, up and down. That's one. Up, 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 and two. Up, 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 and three. Up, 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 and four. Up, 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 and five. Up, 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 and six. Two more. Up, 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 that's seven. And up, 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 and that's eight. Great job. Here we go. And reach those arms up and down. That's one. And up, and two, and up, and three, and up, and four, and up, and five, and up, and six, and up, and seven, and up, and then that makes eight. Great job. Here we go. Let's go into nice gentle stretching now with that body. Take and bring that right arm across, and I want you to just Push that elbow over. Let that right arm reach to the back. Good, nice and easy. Left arm comes over. Pull it in and let that arm reach to the back. Wonderful job, good work. And relax it down. Feet come forward, hands to the back of the head. If you're not quite comfortable here, put the arms to the front and push the elbows back. Good work. Excellent job. Nicely done. Good. And relax it down. From here, go to a nice wide base of support. Bring your chin to your chest and sliding down for four, three, two, one, and up for four, three, two, one. Slow and control. Chin to the chest for four, three, two, one, up, four, three, two, one, last one is four, three, two, one, and up for four, three, two, and one. Step those feet back in, bring your chin to your chest, nice slow head roll to the right. Just hold this position here, no need to push the stretch. Good. Slowly roll the face forward and on over to the left. Good. Hang out here for a moment. Nice and easy. Good. Roll the face forward. Chin comes up and now turn your chin to your right shoulder. Great job. And forward. Chin to your left shoulder. and forward. Take a big deep inhale in and exhale reaching down and forward. Great job. Inhale lift and exhale down and forward. Last one. Inhale lift and exhale and I say namaste and I wish you all peace. Have a beautiful beautiful day. Nicely done.
Thank you.